Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if you are new, hello, I am Sephora, or also known as Izzy. And here on my YouTube channel, I make Sims content. The time has finally come. I am so excited to be introducing you all to a brand new Sims 3 Let's Play called the Not So Berry Challenge. This challenge is very popular in the Sims community and was also highly recommended by a lot of you guys. So I know y'all have been waiting for this and y'all know I love me a good challenge. So I am really excited to get into this brand new series. This series is going to be heavily storyline based and based off of a TV show series. So if you haven't seen the Machinima trailer, I highly recommend you to go watch it right now. I know you're all curious to know what TV show series gave me inspiration and the show is called Finding Carter off of MTV. Finding Carter came out in 2014. I believe it is still available for anyone to watch. Unfortunately, it only has two seasons. I have no clue as to why it got canceled, but I loved this series so much. If you're into drama, this is definitely a series that you should check out. If you're not really into anything like that, which is understandable, I will also have a mini summary of the show in my description box down below. Now on to the storyline of Zayla Berry. Zayla Berry, a twin of Zaire and the daughter of Sarabi Berry. Zayla was born and raised in another world that is unknown to her. Throughout Zayla's childhood, she moved a lot. Oddly, she was never told the reasoning behind all of the moving or could grasp exactly why this kept happening. Zayla believes that she's been living a secret life for many years and is curious to know what is going on. Zayla's mother, Sarabi, plays a big part into this storyline. So let's talk about her. Sarabi Berry, a single mother of twins named Zayla and Zaire Berry. She's your typical loving and nurturing mother, but also secretly unhinged. Growing up, Sarabi had a childhood best friend who was not able to conceive with her husband. So with Sarabi being so caring, she came up with an idea, deciding and agreeing to be her best friend's egg donor. During her best friend's pregnancy, her husband started to neglect their marriage by cheating on her with Sarabi. Sarabi knew that what she was doing was wrong because she sincerely loved her best friend, but she just felt in love but also blinded by love. Eventually, Sarabi's best friend caught on to everything and confronted the both of them. This led Sarabi and her best friend no longer being friends. Sarabi was devastated, not because of the end of a friendship. She was also promised by her best friend's husband that he would leave his wife to be with Sarabi if they ever got caught, and he didn't. He wanted to stay with his wife. Once Zayla and Zaire were born, out of spite, Sarabi takes them and moves to a new town to hide her and the twins' identity. She wanted to seek revenge on their father, not her best friend, even though they had become enemies. As time went on, Zayla and Zaire got older, curious, and suspicious about their own mother and where their father could be. Sarabi never talked about their father because she hated him so much for what happened in the past. She held a huge grudge against their father for the lies he had told her. Zayla and Zaire never asked about their father because they knew their mother would respond back by saying, why do you care? He wasn't anything important. He never cared for you guys or he left us for a reason, so drop it. She was a narcissist, and this did nothing but spark their curiosity to look for answers and nothing but the truth. The rules. Like I mentioned earlier, this is a very popular challenge in the Sims community. Usually, I do not read the rules to y'all, but since this challenge was originally made for The Sims 4 and got converted to The Sims 3 and The Sims 2, I will read the rules for those who are not familiar with this challenge. Basic rules. Each hair must represent the color of the generation, but brightly colored skin is not necessary. This is optional, but it is a big portion of the fun. The color of the spouses don't matter as they aren't a part of the challenge unless otherwise stated you can do whatever you please with them. Every generation is supposed to complete both the career and aspiration of the hair unless explicitly stated otherwise. And finally, keep the lifespan on normal. Generation 1, Mint. You're a mischievous scientist that really loves the color mint. You're career driven but still make time for silly pranks and outings with your closest friends. You love luxury and want the best for yourself and your family. The traits your founder must have is vegetarian, green thumb, lucky, eco-friendly, and angler. Aspiration, become a creature robot crossbreeder, and your sim must be in the science career. Rules, master gardening, fishing, and handiness skills. Master the scientist career and complete the creature robot crossbreeder aspiration. And finally, have three good friends. Woo, that was a very long, but very juicy, chaotic, in-depth introduction 
action and storyline. I feel like I did a really good job with this one, so I hope you guys are really impressed with the storyline I created because I've been writing and planning this series for a while now. And yes, this series will have face cam once in a blue moon, maybe every other part, because y'all know your girl be looking busted and I am being so for real. Anyways, we are finally into the gameplay, so let's get to know more of Zayla Berry. Zayla is a young adult. She is a Taurus. Her favorite music is R&B. She likes grilled cheese. Her favorite color is white. Moving on to her traits, she is a vegetarian, eco-friendly, green thumb, angler, and lucky. And finally, her lifetime wish is to become a creature robot crossbreeder. So looking at the family tree, we can see that Sarabi is the mother of the twins. But according to the storyline, you're probably wondering, well, who are the twins' biological mother? And why isn't she on the family tree? And that's because Zayla and Zaire don't know who their biological mother or father is since they were possibly kidnapped as babies. Or is it really considered kidnapped because Sarabi was the egg donor, not the birth mother? But I guess we'll find out later in this series. So here's Sarabi. She is so beautiful. This is the quote unquote mother of the twins. She is hopeless romantic, charismatic, family oriented, workaholic, and insane. She is a single woman, an Aquarius, and a writer. Last but not least, Zaire, also known as the twin of Zayla. Zaire is athletic, kleptomanic, daredevil, good sense of humor, and a party animal. He is a single man, a Taurus, and a criminal. Moving on to Zayla's relationships. She is really close to her mother and her twin brother. She also has a best friend named Michaela. Michaela is stunning, y'all. Hopefully we can see her later on. Zayla is unemployed. She doesn't have any skills, barely anything in her inventory, and she has a little bit of lifetime reward points. Now y'all know what time it is. It is house tour time. Before we get into the house tour, I just want to let you guys know that this house was not built by me. However, it was fully furnished by me. And this house will not be up for download until the first generation is completed. So here's the outside of the house. It looks bomb, doesn't it? But just wait till we get to the inside because I surely did eat down like I ate down to the core. All right, so let's get in here. Let me put these walls down and show y'all the entrance. The entrance, y'all know I love doing me some nice entrances. It is so cute and simple. Here is the living room. There's a lot going on, but you know, I'm still here for it. The kitchen, the kitchen was my favorite place to decorate in this whole entire house. Here is the bathroom. It's kind of small. I'm hoping my Sim can still like maneuver her way through here. The dining area. Here is her bedroom. I... I tried my best, y'all. I think it looks good. I think it's because it's kind of small. This is like the smallest bedroom I've ever dealt with, but you know, it's a starter home for a reason. And here is an extra bedroom that I turned into a place where she can focus on her gardening, AKA flower arranging, because this does not come with the game. This is actually something I came with The Sims 4, but why not get into flower arranging? So the reason why I'm having Zayla get into flower arrangements is because she is not only going to be a scientist, but also a future business owner of a flower flower shop. Zayla has a flower shop currently, but it is not open. She needs to work on her gardening skill and her flower arrangement skill before opening up the shop so that she can successfully sell bouquet of flowers. All right, it is currently a Monday morning. Zayla is just watching some TV. She's chilling, but no girl, we got things to do. We need to get a job and go grocery shopping. So let's go ahead and hit the road. She can actually get the job through the newspaper and go grocery shopping through um, the computer. But we're gonna step out. We're gonna step out and explore the world because it's my first time playing in this world. I don't know how to pronounce it. It will be in my description box down below. I just don't wanna mess up the name because I think it's like a different language. I'm not gonna assume anything, but I know for sure it's it's definitely a different language. So let's go ahead and get this job. And then we're gonna go ahead and head to the grocery store. Not her being naked. Don't do me. Do not get my video taken down already, no girl. Oh, I need a... Yeah, we're just gonna throw that away. And yeah, we're taking a bike. She does have a vehicle. I forgot what kind of, oh, it's a Volkswagen, like a little beetle. I thought it suited her so much in her personality. It's so cute. So she's not gonna be driving that so much often. Maybe if she needs to be somewhere ASAP, she's gonna drive it. But for now, since she is eco-friendly, she's gonna be taking this bicycle everywhere. I like the bike though. <laughs> I like it. Ooh, that lag. Hold on. It's a pretty large world and it's populated for those that wanna download it. Um, I think it's... So beautiful, definitely out of my comfort zone. Y'all know I try to stay with small worlds and worlds that are like city, city girl vibes, but she doesn't give me city. So that's why we're not in a city world. Come on. Oh, next time we ain't taking this bike. We we taking a car to the grocery store because babes, that's, that's not giving anything. All right, ooh, hold on. What kind of building is this? I thought it was the science. Oh, the science building is, 
here. Creative. I like that. Okay. Okay. So Zayla is going to be a test subject making 44 simoleons an hour working Monday through Friday at 9 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. That sounds good. I like that. And off on the weekends. We love to see it. Yes, girl. Congratulations. Zayla just got a new job. Yes. We need to make some money. We only have 25,000 simoleons. All right. No, 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 no. You don't need to go home. I don't even know why I did that. Let's go to this grocery store and get a couple of things. Hopefully groceries ain't too high because ain't nobody got time for that. And you know what? It's early in the day. It is almost 1 p.m. So I'm going to go ahead and have her buy the lottery ticket. If she wins the lottery, which she might, she has a high chance because she is a lucky sim. I'm hoping she don't get too much, but I would love to get like 10K. We're not broke, but we could definitely use something. Because once we get this shop, this flower shop open, a lot of money will be spent. Oh, every, every community lot is like this. I'm here for it. The realism. What else is down here? The grocery store is down here. The salon is down here. And the movie theater. Anything else? Oh, hold on. Hold on. I don't know what that was, but Ooh, who are you? Oh, never mind. All right, let's get like four of each. Not everything, but four of what I can afford. You get it? You feel me? All right, let's get some tofu since we are a vegetarian. Oh, shoot. Hmm. I don't need no links. We just need like fruits and ve I'm thinking of vegans. Hold on, because we could eat cheese. I think. I think. Dang, let me get a potato. You know, I don't think we need a potato because our cooking skill level isn't even that high. But I know for sure we need some eggs and some onions, carrots. There's something that I'm missing that I always freaking forget. Hmm. Or I could be tripping. What else can I buy? I think that's it. 300 simoleons. That's a lot of... That's a lot of money for some groceries, but the way groceries is high right now in real life, I think that might be realistic. Okay, she's going to go play this lottery ticket. I almost forgot about that. And you know what? It's still early. I don't know what I'm going to have her do. I mean, I could get her into her skills, but I really want to show you guys the flower shop. It is called Berry Bouquets Flower Shop. I hope you guys like the name because it took me quite some time to think of something very creative. I might change the name later on when she gets a little bit bigger, but we're going to rock with Berry Bouquets. So freaking cute. All right, we played a lottery ticket. We should know the results by the end of the day. Maybe like 5, 6, 7 p.m. I forgot. Listen, y'all. I don't use that lottery ticket that much. It comes with Into the Future. I'm not a fan of that expansion pack, but that's that's another story. Here's the flower shop, y'all. This shop was also not built by me, but fully furnished by me. Y'all already know the deal. I am not Handy Mandy and will never be. Hold on. Before we get into this tour, what is she doing? Oh, she messed up with the cow plant. I hope she... Ooh, watch where them teeth is going. I hope she does not get gobbled down because they can kill your sims. Yeah. Y'all be on y'all best behaviors. I guess we can start off from over here. We have a little bit of plants here. The cow plant is going to be here. We're going to be taking care of them. I don't know what their gender is, but we're going to call them them. This is going to be an area where Zayla is going to be putting her bouquet so people can grab it on up. We're going to have a garden here. Well, there is a garden here. We have two gardens to take care of. And when we go into the inside, it's just, I love it. And why is the radio on? Let's turn it off. So if you come over here, we have some plants here. They're decoration. Nobody can buy it. Just to fill up some space behind the counter, we have the register and the computer, a little bathroom for herself, and we have the flower arrangement table. So can you please stop playing with the cow plant? Can we feed the cow plant? No, 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 no. He don't need no more food. I mean, they don't need no more food, please. You eating too much. So let's go over here and actually get into the flower arrangement table. Don't go home. You want to act like a fool and play with the cow plant. We're going to get some things done. All right. It is 445. When are we going to go to work again? 9 a.m. We got all the time in the world. I think I might have her hang out with her bestie, Michaela, so y'all can see what she looks like. Maybe go to a club. I don't know if there's any clubs here. Let me see. There should be. There's a, a Neptune club. Why does it open at 9 a.m.? Why does a club open at night 
imagine drinking alcohol at 9 a.m. I'm not here to judge, but imagine drinking alcohol at 9 a.m. It closes at 8 a.m., which is great. We might go there. Or there's another one, too. The local pub, The Fisherman. Why do all these clubs open up at 9 a.m.? Happy hours at 7 p.m. So I think we're going to hit happy hour because we love cheap drinks. Okay, crunk and drunk. How long is this going to take? Because her bar is going up very slow. Do I hear people here? Because why is y'all here? Uh-uh, uh-uh. Why are we, why are we putting holes in my, my lot? This dog got fleas. Not the dog coming in here. I thought I put down this thing where it says no animals. Y'all see this? Does this actually work? It comes with pets and it's supposed to keep like strays off your lot. I mean, I don't think that dog is a stray, but he needs to get off my lot. Or she. Bye, Pep it. Or Peep it, whatever your name is. I don't know why there's people here anyways. This is a closed shop. They can't buy anything anyway, so. Please, I don't want to I don't want to hear the radio. Let's keep that off. And I don't know who's calling us. So we're gonna go ahead and ignore that call. It might be her mom. Y'all better beat it for real. I hear a horse. Oh, that's the cow plant. Please. Listen, it's not my responsibility if you get killed. All right, so we finished something. What does it look like? I want to see open inventory. Nobody told you to eat that carrot. That carrot is for home groceries. So let's go home and put these groceries away since you want to act like a fool. Please. Y'all about to get deleted. The dog included. Unfortunately, Zayla did not win today's lotto. Maybe if she spent more, she'd win more. <laughs> what do y'all think I am? Those lotto tickets cost a hundred simoleons, maybe more. I forgot. Listen. All right, come on, because we miss a happy hour. We need to put these groceries away. Actually, while we're here, let's see if Michaela is down to hang out. I know she has to work too, so let me pause my game real quick while I put these groceries away. Yes. Actually, go ahead and call her while I throw these in here. Dang, that scared the heck out of me. Okay, so let's go over here. If she doesn't want to hang out, we can always call Zaire or we could just go by ourselves. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Hey, she want to hang out. Okay, period. All right, while she's on her way there, I'm going to continue putting these away before something goes rot rotten. I think we have bills. Why do we have bills already? It's only been one sim day. 437 simoleons. Girl, bye. And check the mail too when you get home. Not now. All right. Making my way downtown. Walking fast. Please. Please. Not even walking. We bicycling. Why is everybody riding bikes? It must be the culture here. Holy cow plants. This must be the most trendy spot in town right now. Don't lie to me. Don't freaking lie. There... There ain't nobody here but two sims. A man playing a piano and a man looking at him. Where's the bartender? Where's Michaela? Oh, her mother's at the club. Hey, I guess we can get a good look on Sarabi. Sarabi is a, when I tell y'all, she's slaying. Like, she's not your typical mom. She might be a little crazy for kidnapping the twins, but she's beautiful. They're talking about recycling. I think Michaela is here. I think I... It's a little laggy here. What's what the hold on? Y'all, that lag spike should have been illegal. I don't know what the freak that was, because there ain't no CC in this world. And I think Michaela stood us up. I don't know where Homegirl is, but I guess we can spend some time with Sarabi. I don't mind. Huh? What are you doing? I know she's not joining this this music session. Girl, we're not even like a virtuoso type of sim. Where is the alcohol? Jam with another sim. I don't care to. Bartender! I'm about to leave this place. There's nobody here. I mean, we can keep talking to mom. Let's give her, like, a hug or something. Happy hour is over. Yeah, happy hour is over, and I ain't seen not one bartender. I ain't seen nobody get not one slick of a drink. I know I surely didn't. And we hungry. Well, we're not hungry, but she's hungry. Yeah, give her a hug. And let's make silly faces... Maybe I can convince her to do something. Because y'all know she insane. She'd be probably down to do anything, but I don't know. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, why are we doing that? Why, why are you mocking your daughter? What? 
oh, maybe this is her insane tree kicking in. But listen, you ain't going to talk to me like that. Like, I know you my mom. I know you my mom, but we don't go down like that. Oh, my God. Be so for real. Be so freaking for real because I don't think there's no shower up in this piece. Not even a pool. Can I self extinguish? No. Are you being so. Y'all, I'm going to have a mental breakdown. I'm going to have a mental breakdown. Y'all, Zayla's going to have to jump in a lake. I don't know if she can swim or if she can't swim, but we about to jump in a lake. Oh my God, I hope Sarabi doesn't die. That's not supposed to be in the storyline. So let me go ahead and reset her. Because y'all... Mm -mm. It's not supposed to go down like that. Let me see if that lady's still living. Girl, you're riding a bike while your butt is on fire. All right, she's still living. Sorry, I got hung up on something. What did she say? Maybe we can meet up sometime. Uh, yeah, I, I can't even read that correctly because I'm so focused on my sim on fire. Get in there. Yes. Yo, I can't stand that deep conversation, Mud. Absolutely not. Oh, my God. Look at the, the view. Pretty. We're going to go home since we got stood up. And we started a fire. Wait, I wonder if that brought down your relationship with your mother. I mean, it did a little bit. I don't know why she was mocking us. What is there to mock? I don't see what's the the point of making fun of your own child. But whatever the case may be, she might get stuck right there. So let me teleport her up here if possible. Ooh. Yeah. Okay, that worked. We need to go home and get a shower because, girl, you look burnt. Burnt, burnt, burnt. <laughs> Imagine the first freaking part. My sim is already cutting up, catching on fire. T. There's always a fire in my stream or in one of my gameplays. I can't. I can't. I can't. All right. So I'm going to have her use the bathroom, I'll hop in the shower, and I am going to have her eat a quick meal of something. Unless we can make something. We can make organic mac and cheese, a tofu dog, and organic autumn salad. I think we're going to make a salad. Something quick because we got to go to work in a few hours and she's getting tired. So I guess I will see you all in the morning. It is now the morning. Zayla just woke up. She is currently feeding her goldfish named Minty. If I have time in this part, maybe when Zayla gets off of work, I would love for her to adopt a dog. I don't know if y'all peep the little doggy stuff around the house, but she is definitely going to get a dog because I always have my Sims get cats. So this time we're definitely going to switch it up. I don't know if I want a big dog or a small dog. I'm aiming more for a small dog because we don't have enough space in the house for a big dog, but maybe in the future. So yeah, she is grocery shopping online. I need to get some things to start up a garden, like a little small garden. This is going to be the garden for her house. I forgot to show y'all the garden in the backyard. It's not too big like the one at her flower shop, but it's it's something. So I think we can flower. I mean, not flower. I think we can plant these for now for 66 millions. Not bad. So here's the garden. See, it's not, not so special. It's medium size. It looks small, low key. So we're going to plant the apples in the back. Wait, what? Terrain. What's wrong with the terrain? All right, we can put it there. Carpal is going to come in an hour. We're going to ignore that carpal. I actually need to go get that mud to get rid of it because I don't care. We're an independent girl. All right, plant these here. And we can plant... Dang, I'm gonna have to rearrange this later on because I don't like how it's looking. And then we could plant the grapevines. Oh, wait, I mean the tomatoes. Right, yeah, there. Yeah, we're definitely gonna have to rearrange this. Forget the carpool. I am going to be taking my bike to work. Thank you very much, kindly. Hopefully, we're not gonna be late. Girl, it is 8.08. .08. She wants to read a book about gardening. We could to make it go a little faster. Hurry up. It's 825. We need to work hard. Oh, what else can we do? Relax in this specimen closet. I don't know about all that now. It says it could hurt your job performance. Yeah, we definitely not going to do that. Meet fellow scientists, geek out with fellow scientists, or do some research with the boss. Independent. I need something that's going to like boost. 
but not stress her out. Let me think about this because y'all know I always press work hard. Not her work outfit, girl. We need to change that. It's it's mint. Y'all see the mint or blue? Y'all see the mint. All right, let's do um, work hard. I don't really care to build a relationship with my boss right yet. Who is my boss? Jane. She's a fertilizer analyst. I like that. Not you want to go to France. Girl, please. We got other things to do. Money to make, okay? You're late. You're late on your first day of work. That's embarrassing. <laughs> Girl, get this stuff in. I will see you all when she is out of work. Zayla is now off of work. She earned 212 simoleons and she is not happy. Homegirl is stressed out almost to the max. It's okay because you worked hard and your performance is... <laughs> I was about to say in the middle, but it ain't even in the middle. Oh, now you want to drive your car. She's like, forget the bike. I need to go home immediately, but I'm actually not going to have her go home. I want her to like maybe hang out with her brother since we haven't seen Zaire yet. He might be working. Um, This is where they live. I did not mean to click that. That's where they live, but it doesn't look like their home anyway. So I don't know. Maybe she can go out fishing with him or go to the summer festival with him. So let's see if he's down to hang out. She wants to visit the art gallery. You're not really into art. You must be bored. That's what it is. All right. Um, Is there like a... I know we can fish at the beach. But I want like... Like, yeah, a lake. Yeah, let's go to the lake. He might not be down to do that. He is not into anything like that. Oh, he's working. Call back in an hour. Oh, I can't occupy myself in an hour. Let me get my fun back up. Let me check on these plants. The plants are good. We can watch some TV for the time being. Or actually, we can make a little online dating profile. You know, it wouldn't hurt to find a little bit of love. If y'all didn't know, well, I didn't tell y'all. My sim is pansexual. Shout out to my people that are pansexual. Who's dinging on my doorbell? Oh, snap. Hey, Michaela. Hey, y'all. Look how pretty she is. Ignore the earrings. That I don't think that's her every day because she's not supposed to have them accessories on. That is not what I assigned her. Anyways, nor the shoes. Let me go ahead and greet her over here. Yes, yes. Let's create this profile. Slim. We love to see it. Greet her. And let me see if I can invite her inside. Yeah. Ooh, she wants to browse online dating profiles. We'll do. We'll do. And what else? Oh, no. We're not doing that. How about I drag up your phone just a little bit? Because your best friend is here. Now you want to show up. Maybe she feels kind of guilty for leaving her out like that yesterday. Hi, you cutie. You let her in. Um, Michaela is lesbian for those who are wondering and what's about to happen. Oh, they talking. Okay. Well, let's, let's give her a hug, a friendly hug enthused about work. Maybe she had her first day of work today. Who knows? But she is in the medical field, which is pretty cool. Let's show her a funny video and not to ask to be surrogate mother. Absolutely not. Let's discuss favorite tv shows and talk about gardening since we started where was that at talk about gardening since we started up our garden maybe she's enthused actually you know what since michaela is here maybe we can go fishing with her i wouldn't mind i think she'd be down to do that how do i do this let's form a group not me forgetting how to play the sims it's been some time y'all it's been some time what's this why are we flirting why are we why are we flirting? No, ladies, please, please. Hold on. Hold the horse. Hold the horse. I want to form a group, not get down and dirty. <laughs> I know y'all been best friends for years, but we, we ain't moving that fast. Okay, form a group. I hope you're down to hang out with me. There's people outside my house. Ice cream man, kids. Beat it. All right, what did she say? I love to hang out. Hey, we could go swimming or just have a nice chat. Girl, you just want to get in these drawers. That's all. That's all. All right, let's go to this lake. Where is it again? It's all the way over here. So visit lot with group. And we're going to get this fishing skill down. We're going to get all these skills down, even though it's a lot. That gardening is going to be the hardest one. No, the handiness. 
uh-uh, they need to find me a mod. I need to find myself a mod to make that a little quicker, cause... Are we taking separate cars? Oh, she's driving. Hold on, okay, Michaela. She's trying to show off. All right now, I ain't paying you gas money. That's not how it works. Let me stop. All right, so here we are at the lake, wherever the lake is. Dang, Michaela, dang, y'all on a move, on a run. All right, so let's go ahead and fish. I don't know if she's gonna tag in with us on fishing. That's her decision, but we are going to fish to work on this fishing skill. Not her on her phone, please. You're supposed to be giving me this attention or attention, bestie. All right, we're gonna have her fish until she catch five fish or gain a skill. Let's do gain a skill, it might take some hours. But I don't want to leave her like this the whole entire time. That's rude. That's not so friendly. It says the fish don't seem to be biting here. Um, yeah, I'm not going to waste my time. Maybe I'll come back to it later. All right, let's talk some more to Michaela. Let's consider attractiveness since she did flirt with us. I mean, can y'all see Zayla getting with her best friend? Hmm. They do have some similarities. They're compatible. I wanna see what happens if we give her like friendly yellow flowers. Like girl, I'm just giving you these flowers because you remind me of a flower. Oh, eight out of 10. She finds Michaela to be gorgeous. No, not the date. Not the... Do you know what goes together, me and you? Oh no. Oh, but I'm here for it. She wants to have a great date. Um, yeah, I could lock that in. Maybe we can like go see a movie or go out to eat. It was not supposed to go down like this, y'all. I just wanted to hang out with her and go fishing. So let's see a movie. Let's see like a love movie. Hmm. I don't know. I low key feel like they would like this movie. I don't know why. Since she's in a medical and she's into like science, like something with psycho, I think she would, they both would like it. I was about to say she, like she's the only one here. All right, come on girls. And then we're gonna go out to eat. Yeah, watch a movie. Hopefully the movie does not cut off on our way there. And she's still driving. Okay, Michaela, you might get some brownie points. You might get some brownie points. <sighs> Where's this theater? Oh yeah, it is down here. So the movie is over and Zayla did not like the movie. I thought she would enjoy it, but I guess not. She said, saw a terrible thriller movie. That was thriller. I mean, it kind of makes sense though, but I couldn't figure out which like movie would be like romance. So it's okay. They're just flirting it out right now. I was going to have them go and eat, but I changed my mind since she is getting a little bit tired. So I want to see if she can invite her to the crib. Not her rejecting holding the hands. But y'all over here are complimenting each other's appearances and stuff and giving flowers and asking to be together. I don't know what's going on, y'all, but I'm kind of here for it. Maybe Michaela always had these feelings for Zayla when they were kids up into teens and now they're older and she's like, girl, I want you. And Zayla's like, maybe I'll flirt with you for the fun. <laughs> maybe they could get a little frisky on the couch. Let's see. I don't know if they're going to woohoo or anything. Not her. Please. You can come a little closer. Sit. I said sit. Oh, please. Please. Hey. Okay. She said turn on the radio. I was getting a little awkward. All right. Let me see before you get up and go to bed. See if she wants to cuddle and then see if she wants to spend the night. Is that appropriate? I'm not going to do that. She got her own place. I'm getting a bit sleepy. I should head home. I had a great time. We should get together again soon. Y'all, Zayla wants to kiss Michaela for the first time. Hold on, girl. No whip, whip, they. That's my song. <laughs> got carried away. I can't believe that. I mean, if that's what she wants, why not go for it? How do y'all feel about it? Hmm, I think I might go ahead and complete that when we see her next time. I don't know if we're going to see her tomorrow, but. Oh, oh, oh. 
a meter strike? Why is all of this happening? Oh my god. Oh my god. Y'all. I'm so happy that did not land on Michaela or Azela. Or the house. We just had a meter strike. A meter shower. And we just, she was just, my son was on fire a day ago. If I don't have bad luck in The Sims, then I don't know what it is. I will see you all in the afternoon. It is now the afternoon. Zayla just got off of work not too long ago. And right now she is tending her garden. Y'all, I am still shocked about that meter strike last night. Like imagine you seeing this big behind rock in your backyard. But we're going to go ahead and collect that because I think that's really, really valuable. Along with these little baby rocks too. Oh, snap. She is level three in the gardening. Hold on. Wait, I thought we had a cooking skill level. Oh, I'm tripping. Anyways, that's good. Yeah, we want to fertilize these plants, but I don't care to do it right now. When she gets those rocks, I think I'm going to go ahead and read our online dating messages to see if we have anything. And then we're going to browse because she wants to meet someone online. Y'all, she also did have the wish to text um, Michaela, but I accidentally canceled it out. So she definitely wants to get in contact with her, maybe hang out and see where things go. Like I said, I don't know. I don't know if it's going to happen today because we have so much to get done. This gardening right here is going to take about five some hours. But I think I do have a mod to make the process a little more faster because it ain't cutting it. And the way it's bringing down her needs, please. All right. Oh, we're done. Oh, look, at, look how beautiful it looks now. I still need to rearrange it, but I'll do it later. Maybe off camera. Let's see how much this rock is worth. Wow, almost 4,000 simoleons. All right, we can keep having meter strikes. I wouldn't mind, honestly. Give me more valuable rocks. How about this one? Uh, 20 simoleons. It's something. And this is almost 30 simoleons, 28 simoleons. She wants to buy something at least worth. Oh, wait, there's one more. I mean, we that ain't going to be worth not a dime. So let's leave it. Should I sell this other stuff that comes with her garden? Or should I keep it for like the flower arrangement table? I think I should keep it. All right, let's see what we got. I don't think we got anything. I don't know how to say their names, but he says, hey, want to be friends. And the other dude says, I'm kind of new at this. You seem pretty cool. Want to give me a call sometime? Y'all look old. I'm going to think about that. I'm Y'all might be married with five kids and I'm not trying to step in. Oh, actually, he's not that bad. He sent us a message. They could be kind of compatible, though. Like, she's eco-friendly. He's eco-friendly. And I think she likes the outdoors, and he does, too. He is a Sagittarius. I love me some Sagittarius. Benjamin. Oh, you look like a serial killer. So I did make a male sim. I don't know if my sim is going to necessarily get with him, but I could definitely see Zayla being friends with Enzo. So here's Enzo, y'all. He is an Aries. He is eccentric, friendly, good sense of humor, loves the outdoors, and socially awkward. He likes Goopy, Goopy Carbonara. I don't know why I was struggling so hard to say that, but I got it down pack. He likes songwriter music, and his favorite color is aqua, and his body type is more to love. Y'all, he is fine. But let's be real. He is fine. And he looks better in person. Just wait till we see him. So we're going to send him a message. See if he is down to hang out, be friends and see where things go, you know? And I want to see if anybody else is on here that's attracting or let's look at the girls. No, because why did I see her brother on there? He's trying to find some love too. Yeah, these guys are busted and rust. I mean, he don't look too bad. I think I might accept his message. I don't know. He gives me wealthy. He might have some money. All right. The girls. Her mom is on here. Please. Michaela. I want to see what happens if I send Michaela a message. I'm, I'm curious. And I just realized her traits changed around. That hydrophobic is not supposed to be one of her traits. Not my game doing the bust down already. Please. All right, we need to take care of yourself. You need to eat something. So let's make some dinner, organic mac and cheese, and take a shower. And then we can go to bed. It's 6, 6, 620, girl. And you're tired because of working. 
we're halfway there. I'm doing good. I'm so proud of myself. Maybe to spare time after she's done eating, instead of taking a shower, we can see if there's any pets up for adoption at the shelter. Cause y'all know I did say I wanted to get a little dog, puppy. Well, I would prefer a puppy, but if it's no puppies, then I will be fine. The world isn't gonna end. Um. Yeah, forget those rocks. I wanna see if Michaela's home. I just wanna be nosy. Where does she live again? Michaela is home and her mom is home. We only know company. We've been having company for the past couple of days. Let's just see if there's any dogs up for adoption or if, if there's any in the neighborhood. I haven't did, well, we can check. I haven't did it in a long time, so we can check that out. All right, these are the cats. All right, let's look at the dogs. Oh my God, the names are so freaking cute. Bear, Pochi, Gabby, Lakia, Noodle, Bobby. Oh my God, y'all, look a bear. Look a noodle. I mean, Lakia is cute too, but her face look like scary demon time gabby look like she's smiling but pure evil oh my god bear is a pit bull terror terrier he's friendly noodle is a mutt he is a genius and lazy i think i would prefer a friendly dog over a lazy dog genius doesn't uh. Noodle's cute though, but i feel like bear would suit her the most and i don't know if noodle's gonna be big or not it says small dog, but they be lying. Oh, wait, bear might be big. Decisions, decisions. If I could just take the both of them, I would, but we ain't got the space. So I think I'm gonna go with bear. Bear is so freaking cute. I'm gonna keep the name bear for now, but if y'all have any male puppy name suggestions for me, feel free to leave them in the comment section down below. It'll be very much appreciated. Girl, you don't need to be playing no video games. You need to use this bathroom, take a shower like you were supposed to be doing, but I got distracted and we need to get ready for this puppy it is almost 9 p.m so we're gonna fill up this bowl we got the toys we got the bed see we're we're all ready for him whenever he's ready to get here and they should be bringing him over in like an hour or so hopefully not too long make sure my garden is locked up before these zombies come in here yeah it's locked period they ain't coming up here and who are you nicole what are you looking at the view, oh my God, the moon. You need to scramble. Oh, she was about to be a zombie. Yeah, I'm glad I locked it. And why are you walking them out? Oh, this must be the lady bringing me my puppy. Oh my God, Bear is here. Bear is sleeping. He ain't even loaded. He ain't even loaded. Wait, go here or not. My baby is here, but he's not loaded. I want to see. <gasps> I'm in love. I haven't had a pit bull in The Sims in so long. Look at his long whiskers and his eyes. He got brown eyes. Stop because let's feed him a treat. And oh, can we do anything else with him? I want to hug him. Kiss him. I think he's too small for all of that. That is so freaking cute. Learn. Are you dancing? What are you doing? Go home. Go back in the ground, you zombie. All right, did we put the food in the bowl? We did. Okay, Um, his fun is going down. So let's do something with him real quick, even though we're tired. Let's... Hmm. We could talk to the dog? What kind of mod is that? How about we play tug of war with him? So cute. Girl, you've been supposed to give him that treat. I'm living for this moment. I love him. Y'all, back to the name suggestions. I would love any name suggestion that would be like mint related or like blue related or his name could be blue. See, the fish name is already minty. So I don't want his name to be minty, but I would love for his name to be something mint related or like blue tur turquoise related. I would love that. All right. So he's going to go to sleep. Actually, I'm going to have you just sleep, not lie down. 
sleep and she is gonna go to sleep and we're gonna be ready for a new day i am gonna end this part right here if you enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe if you're new and i will see you all in the next part bye everyone